Hello YouTube, my name is my account 800 Um, I've been getting a lot of recommendations on command blocks. Um, mostly about the scoreboard command because that's the most popular and that's what people use for a lot of their, um, cities. Well, have you ever d had this problem appearing on screen? Yes. You may know it. It's player offline. Are you having trouble with it? Oh, well, that's why I'm here. I'm here to help you fix it. You're going to need a lot of command blocks, and I'm going to show you every single part of the commands. Um, if you want to, you can pause the video at any time, but I will be viewing all the command blocks uh, for a long stretch of time. So, yeah, let's get right into this. First step, we're going to need four chain command blocks, one repeating command block, one command block, one observer, one redstone block, one comparator. So what you're going to do first is you're going to get you're going to get your repeating command block. You're then going to place your chain command block like this as so. You may be wondering what's inside the red command block. The red command block is just a repeating command block set on repeat, always active and slash test for at a slash test for at a test for all the players in one server. Meaning, you see on my right, you see on my right how there's only one player in the server right now. Well, if it was player offline right now, it would be a different story. Because player offline would be filling up the entire side of the screen. The first command is going to be test for at A, and that's going to be your repeat command at always active. So it always tests for players. And if you don't. Um, and if you want also a tip, make sure you do slash set ticking area. It also helps when slash ticking area helps when you are far away from the cam uh, command blocks. So as you can see, I'm really far away from my scoreboard command blocks that's not even set up yet. But watch, I'm really far away. It wouldn't even add right now if I didn't set a ticking area. Well, look what it does now. Scoreboard, players, add at a money uh let's go 100 or 10 bucks but wait there's no thing near me none of the command blocks are near me and that's not even set up yet well across the city is actually a secret command block chamber that i have that hosts my anti-griefing the economy and everything it's one of the most important things so after you place this repeating command block, make sure you have this arrow right here, this arrow right here. Make sure it faces into this chain command block or else this wouldn't work. Like if you just place command blocks like this, this command block's input wouldn't be going into this chain command block's input. I hope that makes sense to you. So what's gonna be in the chain command block is slash execute at a which means at all tilde space tilde space tilde space scoreboard players operation at p money display equals at p money well if you're trying to set up coin you're going to put coin display so what you're doing is if you want your uh future me here um uh, make sure you make two scoreboards one titled money or whatever you want and then another one titled money display or uh coin display if your name's coin do coin display um this will ensure the data of the scoreboard saves how do i put this if you want people's money to save to the server for the next time they join you need to have a second money thing to once to display the name one is to save all the data from that for the money so this is the command. You may pause here or watch through. Great. Now, once you have completed this, opposite from the arrows, please put a comparator down like this. Do not put it down like this because this is wrong. Um, if you want to know if you did it right, these lights shall come on, uh, indicating that you have, or that this block is powering the redstone comparator because it found a person, which is me. You're then next gonna put a piece of redstone 
Oh, sorry. Uh, I have light blocks in the stadium, so you can't really place. Uh, so, but you don't want to add the, um, you don't want to add the redstone too quickly. Add the observer, but make sure the camera is facing towards the repeater like this. So that way, when you put it, this this observer will detect the block update and power the. So watch. What the observer does is it detects block updates. So next, what you're going to need to also is add a command block down here. This is going to be your regular command block. It's going to be slash scoreboard objectives, remove money display or coin display, anything you want, basically. You just have to make two scoreboards, one for that. So then you're going to crouch. Make sure these arrows are facing all the same way. So, boom, like this. It should look like this. As long as the arrows are touching each other, you're fine. Your command block is going to be slash scoreboard objectives, remove whatever you want right here, display. Your next command block is going to be slash scoreboard objectives, add money display, space dummy money. Scoreboard objective set display sidebar money display. That's what this looks like. That's just setting the money on the right bar. Uh, your next one's going to be slash players add at a money zero. So if a new player joins the game, they automatically get added to the scoreboard. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, hopefully this was helpful and I hope you learned a thing. Oh yeah, make sure you place the redstone right here to activate it. So now you have your contraption. Um, feel free to message me on PSN, um, comments, anything. Um, I really hope that in, um, I hope you really enjoyed the video. I uh, hope you found this really helpful. If you found it helpful, please like the video and maybe subscribe perhaps. Um, I will be posting more redstone tutorial command block or more command block tutorials like this in the future. Um, my account signing off. Whoa, whoa, whoa! No, no, no! Not the outro yet. If you guys didn't know, in the um, description down below and on a lot of my videos now, I'm starting to include ban appeals. Where if you feel like you're unfairly unbanned or something you could actually get unbanned somehow but that's only if it's logical and also if you want to sign up for staff that will also be in the description down below and also make sure you follow me on discord that is in the about section of my youtube channel and it's also in the description down below um thank you for watching and enjoy the rest of the outro